Hello everybody and welcome to a quick video on skipping the final stage in any run. With the anniversary update around the corner for you console gamers, you have been very patient. Good job. I figured these tips will help you all out quite a bit and uh, for the rest of you, uh, better late than never, right? Here's the gist. You don't actually have to charge the pillars at all in order to fight Mithrix. If you can make it up to the arena on your own, you can walk straight on in and begin the fight with Mithrix just like the good old days. Ah. Now, on some runs, the if you can make it is a bit easier said than done. However, the good thing is that there are multiple methods of skipping with some being as simple as just playing a given survivor. Aside from those, the rest of the methods can be accessed on any run regardless of your survivor choice, given you have the required items or equipment. Starting here with the survivor specific skips, these methods only require that you A, play the survivor mentioned, Duh. and B, choose the correct loadout. Loader, Artificer, and Captain can each traverse commencement all the way on up to Mithrix with absolutely zero loot. For the loader, just play the loader. It doesn't matter which loadout you take or which path you choose, just start swinging around and you'll eventually make it on up. If your Spider-Man skills aren't quite up to par, you can always take a break halfway up to the arena by standing on the fingers, as I like to call them. This resting spot also applies to every other method I'll go over. For the Artificer, you'll need to take her Ion Surge special ability. <laughs> Gross. <laughs> hey, uh, yeah, I know. I didn't say it was going to be pretty, did I? Simply take Ion Surge and push the button whenever it's off cooldown. Make sure you are hovering with her passive at all other times. Bam. Easy. Stuff. Finally, on the captain, are you ready? You'll need to take his alternate utility, Meme Strike, I mean Diablo Strike. If you don't have the ability yet due to the unlock being a bit uh, specific, suck it the heck up. If I could do it on a 44 million HP Mythrix, you can get it done on a 44,000 HP one. Anyway, just shoot yourself with Diablo Strike. Don't sprint around, do not jump. In fact, don't even move. Just sit there, wait the 20 seconds, and take it like a man. No, seriously, sit dead center, and when the blast makes impact, you will get a one one-way ticket to Mithrix via Mr. Captain's Wild Ride. All right, let's move on to the methods that work on any survivor, but requires specific items or equipment to pull off. Starting here with the easiest one, simply having the eccentric vase equipment. There are no additional items necessary. The vase alone is all you need. Look up, get as close to the lip of the arena as possible, hit the vase, and take a slightly less stressful ride than the captain. The Milky Chrysalis is also a great equipment for skipping. However, you'll need quite a bit of movement speed and or a couple fuel cells to get all the way up before the act activation runs out. Remember to pause on the fingers if need be. Finally, if you have a head stomper, legendary, and at least one wax quail, you can quail jump off of the top of the rescue ship's bubble shield and more than likely get all the way up to the top in a single jump, provided you have a few energy drinks or goat hooves as well. The more movement related items that you have, the better your odds are of reaching the top in a single jump to the point where if you have an absolutely insane amount of hooves, drinks, and quails, you can probably reach the top without the head stomper. However, this is easily the least consistent method out of the entire bunch as it almost always requires the head stomper to work. You are much better off just looking for a vase or a chrysalis at every equipment multi shop if your goal is to skip pillars. And one final note here, given the wide variety of mobility items and their effects on different survivors abilities, the methods I went over here are definitely not the only ways to skip the Mithrix, but they are the most consistent ones as in the ones that you will most likely be able to use in your runs. And that covers all of the information on skipping commencement and heading straight to Mithrix. Want to let me know how I missed tons of methods, such as having a single Harley afterburner on Rex and repeatedly spamming his utility? Let me know with a like or dislike on the video and a comment below. You can check out my stream at twitch.tv slash woolygaming and consider joining our Discord server as well. Thank you for watching.